All right, we're recording. Hey gang, Andy here, coming at you with an unboxing of my latest MP3 player, the Sansa Clip Zip. So as always with these unboxings, we'll take a look at the box and then we'll uh, open this bad boy. So yeah, stay tuned. Okay, so here is the front portion of the Sansa Clip Zip here. And uh, here, let me get that frame. It just shows the actual Clip Zip right here. And then uh, some other stuff on the box saying uh, it can read or it can uh, play audiobooks, you can listen to FM radio, it has voice recording, it's uh, AAC compatible, so it's compatible with uh, like, uh, I think like iPod stuff, uh, battery life up to 15 hours. And it uses micro SD cards, which I think it includes, or maybe not, I'm not sure, but in any event, it has 4 gigs internal memory, so I can always upgrade later, so that's nice. So, um, let's look at the top. Uh, not much to it, just says Sansa Zip Clip, MP3 player, 4 gigs, black. Wow. <laughs> then, going on the right hand side here. Oh, uh, oh there we go. It's kind of thin, but here, let me focus in here. Wow. It says uh, minimum system requirements, stuff like that, nothing too. Too exciting. Okay. Then going on the uh, left hand side here, uh, shows what the package contains a Sansa Clip Zip MP3 player, USB 2.0 transfer cable, earphones, and a quick start guide. And then uh, it says it in different language uh, supported formats MP3, WMA, secure WMA, audiobooks, Hog Vorbis, FLAC, and AAC compatible, DRM free iTunes. And there's a better look at it right here. Right there, yeah. Okay. And now let's uh, take a look at the back. So it just says, you know, a bunch of stuff. You know, plays music, podcasts, has a stopwatch feature, enhanced 1.1 inch color screen. <laughs> Chargeable ba battery lasts up to 15 hours. Expandable uh, memory slot with the micro SDHC card slot. I think it can do up to 32 gigabytes. And uh, some basic stuff you can find on Facebook at SanDisk. Blah, blah, blah. So, yeah. Oh, yeah. I uh, can't forget the bottom. So, yeah. Not, not too much interesting stuff going on at the bottom. So, yeah. Um, now we've looked at the box. Let's open this bad boy. Stay tuned. Okay. So, with that said, let's begin opening the box. So, uh, seems like a pretty standard open. Just open the top. A little bit of tape right there, so just kind of put your finger and throw the box a little bit, but it's all good. Alright, so open that up, pull out the little uh, plastic sleeve here. Oh, and a bunch of goodies in the back too. And uh, nothing else really in the box, so we can uh, put this to the side. And uh, we'll get to this later, so flip around it. Whoa. Dropping stuff. <laughs> so flip around to the other side where all the goodies are. Um, you have your little uh, USB cable right here. That off to the side. You have your, uh, your quick start guide right here. Just a little basic manual thing to do about that over there. You get like a little uh, promotional thing where you can download stuff from Sandisk, like through Rhapsody and stuff. I didn't even know Rhapsody's still around. You guys know that? I don't know. Oh my gosh, the little tiny CDs. Oh, they're so cute. The little Game Boy, or the little GameCube disc. Has a uh, Rhapsody software inside, I guess. So, that's cool, I haven't seen one of these little discs in a while. And then a uh, pair of stock headphones right here. And a little uh, anti-theft sticker right there, if you guys can see it stuck on. So, that said, turn to the piece de resistance. Is the MP3 player. Just put that out the little plastic shell there. And here is the MP3 player. And it actually feels incredibly light. So it's pretty cool looking. Um, give you guys a little look at it here. If I can get a good focal point here. Okay, so uh, there's a little color screen here. It's got a little sticker on top of it. Got your back button, play button, your uh, Reverse, and then your forward button, menu button, and random ass selection button. And 
then on the right hand side here you have your micro SD slot and then your headphone jack headphone port and then up top you have your little power button here then on the left hand side you have your USB uh, plug and then your uh, rocker buttons for volume then on the back you have uh, the namesake of the clip zip the clip <laughs> and uh, yeah pretty much all there is uh, to this little, little guy um, I got this based on uh, <clears throat> the one that my uh, little brother Raj has uh, he has something similar he has the, uh, the older model though but it's pretty much the same thing and uh, I got it for about 50 bucks so I figure, you know, that's pretty cool. And I wanted an MP3 player that didn't have uh, the touch screen, just cause if I'm jogging or something like that, I don't have time to pull out my phone or my touch screen thing go beep, 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 beep. You know, I just want, you know, actual dedicated buttons. So if it's like in my coat or my pants or something, I can just like press it and there you go, move on to the next song. Easy day, easy day. So yeah, this is the Andy song. Signing off for now. Thanking you guys for tuning in to this little unboxing of the uh, Sansa Clip Zip and uh, for watching my other videos. Also, I thank you guys for liking, thumbs, commenting, subscribing, and a few friends to the party. And hey, as always, we'll see you right there, you, next time. Catch you later, guys. Bye.